Here is a simple video that shows you how to set up the Frank Olsen IR repeater set. One of the first things we need to do is to plug in the power supply. The second thing we need to do is to plug in the receiver bulb which goes into the side marked receiver. Now the other, the other end of the receiver bulb, which is here, which is designed simply to pick up the remote control signal. Then we need to plug in the small emitters, which in the side that says emitter point. The end of the emitter is then connected, as you can see there, to our piece of AV equipment over the point of where the remote control light is emitted. Now the way the system works once set up is very simple. You will see that the remote control, once operated, sends a signal to the bulb which is placed on the outside of the cabinet, normally at the base of the TV and out of sight. That then sends a signal to the IR repeater that then sends a signal further along to the emitter point which relays that signal to the, inter to the remote control point of the AV equipment. It's a very simple, very effective system. The IR repeater box is located on the underside of the top panel in the cabinet which means then all your AV equipment can be used with the remote controls with the doors closed. Now occasionally, depending on the equipment, it might take a little bit of playing just to find where the point of the uh, infrared signal is. And that just takes a little bit of adjustment until you find it. Then simply, using the self-adhesive pads, locate the emitter onto the equipment. And there we have it, how to set up the Frank Olsen IR repeater set.